A kind of a classic spring day around the mid-Atlantic. Mild temperatures, 60s and 70s in most areas. Some scattered showers, a few thunderstorms popping up here and there. Again, pretty typical for late March in the Baltimore area. About 70 right now at the Inner Harbor and down at PWI Marshall Airport. It's 67 in Sykesville. Yeah, you move north, it's a little bit cooler at Stewartstown there at 57. Jarrettsville up in Hartford County at 58 degrees. And kind of depends on if you're underneath the clouds and picking up a shower. Temperatures will briefly cool and then bounce back as the sun comes back. 70 in Frederick, a chilly 50 at Oakland this hour. And we had had some substantial rain in spots. Notice these green areas up here in Cecil County, parts of Hartford County. 1 to 1.2 inches of rain, fairly common. Also, a line of showers put down some decent rain up in northern Carroll County into central and eastern Frederick County, about an inch there. But other areas fairly light, some areas not getting much measurable rain at all, like around Annapolis or Centerville or Easton, at least in the past 24 hours. And you can see there is sort of a, a hole in the precipitation area here, not much falling in the immediate Baltimore Metro or the upper eastern shore. But there are still some scattered showers to watch coming in from the mountains to our west and passing by to our south where thunderstorms have been breaking out in parts of eastern Virginia, trying to get up into southern St. Mary's County. Doesn't look like we have much of a threat of any strong storms here in Baltimore, but just a little farther to our south, the uh, Storm Prediction Center has a marginal risk area identified around Richmond, Norfolk, and down into eastern North Carolina for possible severe storms this evening. It's all because of an area of low pressure that's pretty much passing right over the Baltimore, Washington metro area right now. And this will continue pushing east, allowing high pressure to come in behind it. And so tomorrow should feature quite a bit of sunshine and not all that much cooler. I mean, it's slightly cooler out here, but you add the sunshine and the temperatures should recover nicely tomorrow. Then another rainmaker comes our way. Big storm now moving into the Texas Panhandle. This has got some rain and snow in the mountains, some decent rain in the plains, and this will all be heading toward the mid-Atlantic with perhaps some steadier rains coming in here on Friday. So future cash will show the gradual clearing trend. There's a risk of a shower for the next couple of hours, and then the sky should begin to clear after midnight and tomorrow. Beautiful looking Wednesday with lots of sunshine statewide. Clouds will be increasing Thursday, but I think it stays dry during the day. So if you have outdoor activities planned for Thursday, not a big problem. Late evening going past sunset into the nighttime. Some of these showers off to the west might clip the northwestern suburbs of Baltimore. But the next best chance for rain is during the day Friday. And again, some of that could be steadier, heavier rain, at least for a time during the middle part of the day on Friday. So for tonight, a few evening showers possible, then clearing cool temperatures in the 40s. Highs tomorrow with the sunshine should reach 61 to 66 degrees. So again, a little bit above normal and a beautiful sunny day. A little bit of a breeze out of the northwest at 10 to 15 miles an hour out on the open waters of the bay. Those winds will be strong enough to gust occasionally up to 20 knots, so there is a small craft advisory. In western Maryland tomorrow, temperatures in the 50s, cooling off into the 40s with the clouds moving in Thursday. On the eastern shore, nice looking sunny Thursday and mostly sunny uh, on tomorrow as well. And uh, down on the lower eastern shore, mild tomorrow, slightly cooler Thursday, and watch out for some rain coming in end of the week. Seven day forecast for Baltimore, 64 tomorrow, mostly cloudy by Thursday afternoon with a chance for a rain in the evening. Rain on Friday, but it clears up in time for a nice looking weekend. Highs in the upper 50s and low 60s.